Oh, God. I need to stop yawning. Everyone's gonna think I never sleep. <laughs> huh. I wonder if people will find that attractive. Me never sleeping. Hmm. Well, anyway. I think as soon as I get in here, I'm gonna take a little nap before dinner. I wonder if my roommate turned lover is back home yet. They're probably gonna be knackered as well. Hey, sweetie. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. You are not gonna believe the time I went to bed last night. You were about ready to wake up when I eventually left my desk and came to snuggle up with you. <laughs> I've got to get my sleeping pattern sorted. Huh. No reply. Maybe they aren't back yet. But if that's the case, isn't that their... Hey, sweetie, your keys are on the side. You're back, right? Hmm. I wonder if they're in the shower or something. Hey, are you taking a shower? Because if so, I might just... Uh, oh, I need to quiet down. They're fast asleep on my bed again. Well, actually, I should amend that statement, really. They're fast asleep on our bed. <laughs> that makes me so happy to say. Ah. Uh, are they wearing my hoodie? To. Hey, hey beautiful, I didn't mean to wake you up, I keep forgetting how you like to take a nap after work, <laughs> especially today because today's your long day, isn't it? Uh, I do have to ask though, were you chilly or something when you got home? Why do I ask? Well, it's just your current choice of attire is rather unusual, I must say. <laughs> and I figured perhaps the cold was getting to you. I mean, it is like you to get cold. That's why you're always cuddling up to me whenever I'm doing something. <laughs> Calm down, sweetheart. Don't be silly. Of course I'm not mad. There's no need to look so embarrassed. I don't mind you stealing my hoodie to sleep in. I am your boyfriend after all now. And I think it's become quite a tradition at this point for people to steal their boyfriend's hoodie. In fact, I'm truly honoured. It must mean our relationship is growing stronger. <laughs> Yeah, I know, my baby. You don't have to explain. You were chilly, and you miss me. So in order to remedy that situation, you wrapped yourself up in my hoodie that smelled like me. That's definitely the most logical thing to do, I reckon. <laughs> I totally understand, beautiful. So, what have you been up to today? How was work? Oh, well, that's good news, isn't it? I'm really glad to hear that. So, you managed to get a hearing organised for that promotion you wanted. Hopefully soon, you'll be ascending the ranks of that place once again. And finally, you'll be getting a pay grade that matches the amount of work you do for that company. You deserve to be seen for all your hard work. And even though that place isn't easy... They have treated you fairly in the past, so hopefully they'll treat you fairly this time and give you what you're owed. Well, I mean that's evident by the way I found you. <laughs> 
You're so tired from all your hard work. You just had to sleep the moment you got home. I'm sure you will get that promotion. <laughs> Sweetie, no one works as hard as you do. Okay? You've got this. I promise. <sighs> what did you have for lunch, by the way? Ah, did you? Well, there's no harm in trying to be a little healthier, is there? In fact, I'm really proud you decided to have that. Well done. You know what? I think, as a reward for your healthy eating, tonight we can go get some unhealthy Thai food. <laughs> How does that sound? That defeats the purpose of having a healthy lunch? Does it really though? Because in my opinion, life is all about balance. And I'd say balancing out all that good with something bad is actually the right thing to do. <laughs> oh, I never claim to be a good person, sweetheart. I'm just your person, through and through. Mm. I'm always going to be your person. Make no mistake about that. Always. Oh, you want to know about my day? My day was good, to be fair. <laughs> I've started a new project at work, and me and my team are extremely busy, to be honest. That's actually why I was up all night. I wanted to get ahead. It was just so I could impress everyone with my diligence. <laughs> uh, plus, this client is a make-or-break kind of guy. If we don't nail what he wants, he'll just drop us without a second thought. But if we do get this right, it could honestly do wonders for our company's reputation. So, I've got to get this right. <laughs> that is really sweet, but... That ain't true, unfortunately. I have to disagree, my love. I'm sorry. When my work is concerned, I do have to push myself. I have to be the best I can be, or I won't get anywhere. I also need to set a good example for my team. I'm not the only one burning the midnight oil, you know. <laughs> We've all got to pull our weight, or it just won't function. It just won't work. That's true, hon. I am aware of that fact. I can't push myself too hard or I'll end up burning myself out and then I won't be much use to anyone. <laughs> you know, to be dreadfully honest, I think I'm on the brink of burning myself out right now, actually, come to think of it. <laughs> it's funny you should say that, actually. I was literally just thinking as I walked in the apartment that I could use a good nap. So, uh, all I'm going to say to that is, I wholeheartedly accept your offer, sweetie. Yes, let's cuddle up and have a quick hour's sleep together. Ugh. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, that hits the spot. <laughs> I could tell you were still sleepy the way your eyes were drooping when I was telling you about my day. <laughs> You're adorable. I am so, so lucky to come home to you, aren't I? Uh, 
To come home to my sleepy baby. That's what it's all about. That's what truly makes me happy. I love you too, beautiful. You mean so, so, so much to me. And, yeah, you can keep my hoodie for as long as you want, by the way. That is, as long as I can keep you for as long as I want.